Alright, so the dish fight strat that I've developed, you know, you start with just shooting these guys at the beginning. And you can kind of just immediately dash over here, see this, uh, see the first dropship, just switch to Expedition. And just get those grunts first. You can actually ignore the, the Reaper that you would normally get at the beginning here, because there's some time between the first and the second ship arriving. In the meantime here, you can, you can shoot the Reaper a little bit. Uh, then you probably want to like swap reload, just so you have your ammo. And when you get the second ship, and at this point you can finish off the Reaper with whatever you have. And you'll probably have like a couple grunts to your bottom right here, which you can just punch. Uh, but at that point you probably have all of them. Then you can disembark, either disembark jump or dis uh, just regular disembark. And get these grunts up here. What's nice about this is you don't actually have to be like super quick about this. Uh, because there is there is quite a big time cushion once uh, once you've killed everyone. So ideally those should be everyone. Uh, you can check like in the bottom area here. If you miss like anyone on the first ship, you can check here and just like shoot down here. Uh, if no one's there, continue on to BC. Make sure you're not grabbing the zip line by the way, because that crashes the game. But you're embarking back onto BT. Uh, and once you're back on BT, at this point you don't want to kill anyone. Uh, at this point you're just waiting for uh, for two reapers so you can have, so you're waiting to get two reapers that will be in your view so right now that the last two reapers one is here and one is up here this one up here is kind of unlucky uh, but we'll just hope that uh, he's gonna get in our view so what we're waiting for is endless enemies ended once that has happened you know obviously in runs you won't be able to see in the console but once that's happened you can kill these last two and you can be sure that no one else is going to spawn. And once those two are dead, you can disembark and make your way to the end. And that's always guaranteed to get the uh, the do, right? It's a bit delayed. I'm not exactly sure why it's delayed. Sometimes I feel like if, if you're slow enough, sometimes if you're slow, like the doof happens instantly if you get the last kill. But with this, that almost never happens. I'm not exactly sure what when it's like an instant thing and when it's not but you can tell even though I disembarked like super early pretty much immediately after I killed them oftentimes this thing will be will be down before if, if you disembark too late often oftentimes this will be down before you actually arrive uh, but yeah that's the thing so obviously you won't be able to look at the console when you're doing the dish fight but you can you can use the music as a cue you can kind of shoot them here but the idea is shoot these guys. Let's say, well, I actually didn't miss anyone there, but shoot the guy and shoot these last guys. Punch them and this and disembark. You can you can ignore pretty much all of the stalkers. So you can kill these guys with with an L star or a, or a softball. It doesn't really matter. What you want to do is just like check below here and then get back to BT. And then here I'm just going to listen for a specific point in the music when like the high strings start coming back in. Like around here. See that was actually a bit early, I actually saw one of them respawn there, but that should be... That should have worked. So I'm just going to go. There you go, and that's 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 the sound that you're looking for. And the reason we want to disembark so early before we even hear it is because if we disembark at the moment that we hear the doof, I don't actually know, like it's not really like a bass drop or anything, but like the sound, the sound. You're looking for the sound. If you disembark like pretty much the moment you hear the sound, uh, you'll most likely be too late for this, which is why disembarking early is is a lot more important. But yeah, that's. That's what I've figured out so far. 